Welcome back. A handful of our Iowa high school volleyball teams took part in regional semifinal matchups, hoping to move one step closer toward Coralville. First match of the night takes us to Class 1A. It's two Siouxland squads with some history faced off. Remsen St. Mary set the road to take on Galen Catholic, looking for their first win over the Jays since 2001. First set RSM setting up for the point, but it is blocked by Maya Whitehead, and she'd finish it off with a spike of her own as the Jays come up with the point. Shortly after, nice dig by the Hawks to keep it in play, but it would be Aurora Gable dropping the hammer as the Jays were clicking early. Remsen St. Mary's, though, looking to respond. Check out the awareness right here from Maya Bunkers to stay with the play. She'd find Whitney Jensen, who set up Char Carmendi Ricky for the point. Huge play for the Hawks. Set point for Galen Catholic. Jays moving it around, and it would be Cadence Gable connecting with Rosiah Sitzman for the clincher. It's the number three Galen Catholic squad sweeps Remsen St. Mary's. Three zip. Now for the first of our 2A matchups, Western Christian looking for win number 39 on the season. They hosted North Union in Region 1. Wolfpack had 2-0 in the first set. Warriors aiming for their first point. Abby Verberg and Kenya Winja keep them at goose eggs with a duo block. Western Christian built it off with a 14-5 run and looking for more. Sella Winterfeld stinging it down for the kill as Wolfpack takes set 1, 25-6. Second set, North Union trailing 2-0 but break out of their shell early. Olivia Merrill letting it rip too much to handle. Warriors going on to tie it at twos, but that's as close as they'd get. The set from Hannah Brock to Winja. Look out below. That was a big time hit. Western Christian moves on to Wednesday's regional final in straight sets, 3 0. Staying in Hull and in the same region, Boyden Hull looking to avenge their loss to Central Lion earlier in the season, this time with higher stakes. Lions took set one, but here comes the Comets in set two, tied at 19. Avery Noble finds the hole in the defense as the Comets take the lead. Central Lion refusing to fold, still trailing by one. Lions moving it out to Dion Jansma. She brings down the hammer, and just like that, knotted up at 22 apiece. Boyden Hall bounces back with two straight to four set point, and Greta Van S gives them the big time block. Comets take set two, 25 to 22. More of the same in set three. Noble again with a spike and again sneaking it through the Lion defense. It's Comet Shine Bright for a 3 1 win, setting a date in the regional final with Western Christian. Nearby, number four Hinton looking to make it three in a row against Lawton Bronson, while the Eagles hope for their first win over Hinton since October 2020. Fast forward to the third set. Hawks looking for the sweep. Ashley Corvarna sets up every Burgod and she elevates for the spike. Great start for the Blackhawks. LB looking to get that one back. Eagles moving the ball around. Brooklyn Roeder picks up the kill. Blackhawks adding to the lead. Check out the spike from Bailey Booby. She climbs up the ladder and gets up for the big time spike. And shortly after, it's Booby scoring the point. This time on the serve, it's Hinton gets the ace. The freshman scoring on multiple levels in this one as number four Hinton would go on to defeat Lawton Bronson in a 3 nothing sweep. And finally, let's take a look at our high school regional volleyball scoreboard. Starting with the number six, Newell Fonda Mustangs. They swept Bishop Garrigan. It's 3 0. Newell Fonda will take on AGWSR in the regional title game at Fort Dodge High School on Wednesday. The number 15, Ridgeview Raptors, followed suit in their defeat of South Central Calhoun in Class 2A. Up next, they'll face up against Hinton in the Region 2 finals at Cherokee High School on Wednesday. Both games slated to start at 7 p.m.